I got me and Guido. You're a natural. I'm a natural. <laughs> did you just play an old song, an old Cuban song recently? Yes, or I an did. old song? Yes, I did. Ha! Yeah. Your, your father just told me yeah. that. Oh, God, I wasn't going to do this today. I said, no, oh, I am no. not going to do this today. And I'm like, and I heard tell Rudy I was with him when he played the old Cuban song. Oh. A few days ago, I was playing some traditional Cuban music. I was actually playing that on, on my bass guitar. It was not a song that I usually play. You know, I, I felt that I needed to. And I felt like you hadn't played that song in a really long time. No, I hadn't. He wants to thank you for playing that song. Welcome, thank you. Thank you for bringing the message. Okay. My father passed away from Alzheimer's. Uh, about a year ago. The song that I was playing is an old Cuban song called Sabor a Mi. It was one of his favorite songs. Look, we're very dear friends. I, know. I said I was not going to do this today. I think he led us here. Yeah. To this spot in the store. Because it's private. Yeah. You know, because then I just started seeing other things too. It has to do with the, I, I, I don't know, the buddy of yours that died in the plane crash. He's here. Randy Rose was a musician who I have played with in quite a while. He was the person responsible for my career. Sometimes I ask myself, when I'm in need of advice, I say, uh, what would Randy do? He stands and salutes you. He goes, Rudy doesn't have to do what he does. Because he said, I saw you playing different types of music, and I want him to know that that means the world to me. A couple of nights ago, I participated in an event. I played live, and part of it was my... Oh, my God. My collaboration with Randy in different bands. <sighs> and and his, his family, his, his family was there, too, his sister. And, oh, and so you hadn't seen them in... I, years. Yes, it goes, it's yes, been so long yeah, and it was yeah, so yeah. healing. Yeah. So know what you felt, know that his soul was present for that and thanking you for the amazing and beautiful tribute. The fact that she's sharing her gift is very special. And to know that my friend was there to witness it and, and, and be a part of it, that was that was magical. It really was. Thank you for the message. Oh my god. So people ask me all the time if I read my family and friends all the time. And the truth is, I don't. I hardly ever do. But sometimes when spirit wants it to come through for someone, I mean, come on. You know what happens. Do I really have a choice? Stop giving me all these Zen instruments. What is happening?